Hello friends, uh, this is Dr. Arvi Kuswa, Associate Professor in the Division of Veterinary Technical Complex at FBSC and H. Scott Jammu, RS Pura. Welcome to my YouTube channel and if you are new to my channel, so kindly subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for further notification. So I am going to discuss about uh, case of urolithiasis in a female dog. So this is the lateral radiograph of a female dog. So you could see this is the urinary bladder. The other structure you could see here, so this is the tail of the spleen and this is the area of the liver, this is the pylorus, here is the fundus and this is the cecum and these are the small intestine. So there are some radio opacity in the urinary bladder. So what these radio opaque structure, this is nothing, these are the urinary bladder calculi. The whole urinary bladder is full of the calculi and there is a little space uh, in the urinary bladder. The history of this case that uh, the animal is not uh, urinating in a stream form. So whatever urine is formed, it come out through the urethra in a double form. So there is a pain because uh, whenever uh, the huge amount of calculi is formed in the urinary bladder, so there is a cystitis. So even if you see, so soft tissue density here, this is the cerosal surface of the urinary bladder. So this is the inflamed wall of the urinary bladder. So such calculi definitely causes the severe cystitis. This is the reason why animal feeling pain that is the dysuria. So we perform the cystotomy through the midline linea alba and we remove the these calculi. So you could see here. So these are the calculi which is removed from the urinary bladder. If you see the surface and the color of and the, their texture, so these calculi are is to white in nature. So one question is arise that uh, why is to white calculi is formed in the dogs? We know that uh, dogs urine is a snake in nature and uh, these calculi are forming the alkaline pH. The reason is that uh, female dog or even in the male dog, the most of the calculi is formed after the urinary tract infection. So when there is urinary tract infection, so whatever the bacteria is present uh, that releases the urease enzyme and that enzyme convert the urea into the ammonia and that is responsible for the alkaline in pH. So this is the region. So in the canine urolithiasis, so steroid calculi is basically the secondary to the immunitite infection and this is the reason that why these calculi also called the infection calculi because in the dogs it is mostly because of the immunitite infection. If you want to see that how a cystotomy is performed, so I have given the link in the description box. So go and click on the link and watch the cystotomy procedure. Thank you very much.